it was. Yeah, yeah, there's no escape. I'll press it, I've started you. The bed's up? Started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah boy, Brooklyn Keck New Bar on the home tree stem, you heard me? Yeah, you got it right. Brooklyn Keck New Bar, the home tree stem. What? Yo, we south side of the Thames River, London. And um, supporting my people, seeing the vendors. We get the books, we get the knowledge right here. We get the energy table right here. So we're gonna go on into it. So we're just making some jokes just now off camera. Is, uh, and, and you know I break down about the movies and all that, you know, protection. tell people to put on their, their day lifts. In case you don't know what day lives are, that one come on, let's work. Seven to seven day, I'll show you the movie. Yeah. I might even give one away. They live the movie, I'll give it away. Uh, helps the dream. Only a couple though. Protects you burn dream. it, I want some roadies. Anyway, so when you put your day lives on, basically that like movie, you walk like past the store like this, right? So it would say Iceland. Go so grab that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? So your day lives, without your day lives on, you walk past a, a block like this, it would say Iceland store, okay? Now you look in there, there's a lot of people, copper tone, copper skin people in there, people of color spending their hard earned right? And they're all buying crap, yeah? Because they believe some allegorical story about some guy called um, Jesus or whatever. But anyway, who doesn't exist. So they're all stuck up like this world war gonna happen for one day. And don't realize that most corner stores are open on this crimbo day thing anyway. You follow what I'm saying? But it's allegorical stories. But anyway, so your day lives now. If you put on your day lives glasses in the movie, instead of seeing the word Iceland, it would say, come in, shut the fuck up, and consume. And once you get in there, the temperatures are different. And they put on that sad, softy music, all right? And then it's all based on uh, consumerism and multiple traits. And the dangle things in front of you, like dangling the carrot. How far does the rabbit hole go? I will tell you. So all these pictures, look, he's got his day lives on, man. So instead of saying Iceland, it says, come in, shut the fuck up and consume. Spend money and don't argue about it. Subliminal so, messages. Yeah, subliminal messages, man. So people on the tour, right? Look at these people. 300 pounds worth of shopping for one day. That doesn't really exist. And when they get home, they realize like, they don't even need that. Because you know, as well as I do, and the next man, when you're broke, you go to the dollar store and get your bathroom paper. But when you got money, you show off with your hand face. Like someone's in the line expecting you to wipe your backside with me. That ain't me, pardon. So, when you put your day lives on, you see clearly. You see with clarity. You see with clear vision. Clear brain. You see it for your first time, man. Which means your pineal gland is not calcified. So the dietary comes into that too. You dig me? Keep rolling. They lives, man. So he doesn't see Einstein. He says, "Come in, consume." Another movie the tag for that is the Philadelphia Experiment Part Two, where the Nazis actually won. Because what you gotta remember is that Germany lost the Second World War. The Nazis never lost the Second World War. Hitler and all them ran into Antarctica, went underground, and you're gonna hear a lot about Antarctica, the pyramids, and all that, right? Yeah, and all that. Well, keep it still, mum's the word. Yeah, they may come out because you know the guys in black. It really should be the men in white, because when they come after, they put you in a white room, right? Four by four white room. The ceiling's white. The, the floor's white. It's a white light. You can't sleep. The bed is white. Everything's white. You go crazy. Matter of fact, you won't even know the ceiling from the roof, from the floor, from the wall by the time they finish. Yeah? That's one flew over the cooking plant. London style. Remember, this here is the brain of the beast. People complain about the US. This bitch here, Queen Elizabeth, bitch gave birth to America. This is the first and last state of America. So you only see nothing yet. But what she does, what Queen Elizabeth bitch is doing is good at, is she's very subtle or subliminal as Brother Noel broke down. So she rocks you to sleep. England's good at rocking you to sleep slowly. Like rocking, like, yeah, you're not like the rest of them. Uh huh. You're, you're cool, you ain't, you know, just change your hair a bit because, you know, in work and all that. Because your hair might, you know, you got them dreadlocks. It might get caught in the machinery. Just change your hair. Just compromise the integrity of your divinity. Just give it up. You think? And then people just fall into soup. Because, you know, in London, brothers don't get jobs, right? You can't get employed. Why? We got castrated a long time ago. So the sisters get employed in the city. So they work in the city where the skyscrapers are. And the skyscrapers are symbolic of the trees. So Tarzan is down there, kidnap our woman, Jane, right? And you got some little skivvies that cheat up. And by the time the woman comes back up town, us brothers ain't worth nothing. We ain't got no jobs, we're unemployed on the playbook, we're illiterate and all that good stuff. And they keep mean? sitting down in jail. There you have it. And that ties into the child support thing, which I was breaking down earlier on. That people over here have got it kind of lucky because child support in the US is tied into your pan to your passport, your social security, your credit, and all that. And that's coming here. Facts. 
So where at the moment you can like go out in the country and all that, you know, you can own transport, that's all gonna come to a head. But Malachi, I've told you that years ago. He said they're gonna say farewell to welfare, get it? Farewell to welfare. If you're on social security, guess what? It really means insecure in society. Oh, yeah. Did it? Before the inauguration, generals, vote Dr. Malachi as your president. I'm being real right now. I'm, be I'm really being real right now. Yeah, don't believe the hype, all those rumors and all that you heard what he's in for, he's not. You think me, he's an innocent it's man. It's and y'all gonna wake up. That better on a man than me, isn't it? No. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Hey, let's go. So, the guy pumping these. Yeah, I'm gonna get you on these day limbs, man. What's up? I bought a pair. This is not the pair I bought, but I'm putting them on anyway. We're all gonna have day limbs, though, right? <laughs> see, I don't see Einstein. I see you come in this store, <laughs> buy some juice, eat, and you don't know if it's a turkey or a chicken. We saw you at Gander. It says, it says, it says eat obey, this. eat, <laughs> eat, <laughs> obey, <laughs> and, and, and shut up. But the main thing is obey. Oh, I get it. I, I hear what the sister's saying. You mean, ho, oh, oh, ho, ho. <laughs> I get it now. Hey, oh, hey, hey, hey. Uh, uh, <laughs> it's a ho. This is about Christmas, the season of goodwill. I was downtown London today, right? Oxford Circus, the main shopping belt, the financial belt of the UK, right? And I'm a mile away from Beckenham Palace where Queen Elizabeth resides. <laughs> I'm seeing people sleeping in doorways. In 2016, she's very ill. Oh, I said it, Queen Elizabeth. She can't tell. Still. Let me blow her raggedy ass up. Because they're not even British anyway, they're Greek and Roman. So anyway, let me blow them up, the whole family. I said it. Brooklyn kicked me bar. I ain't scared. There I are cameras it. here. They hey. missed it. <laughs> it's all great. The most CCT planet. The, the CCT camera the most right here yeah, in London. So what they were. <laughs> And remember, this ain't even really London. Real London is the city of London. Right. If you're a soccer player, like my team, Manchester City, 230 miles northwest of this country, if you're a soccer player and you ain't paid your taxes, guess what police they said? They don't send the local Greater Manchester police. They send the city of London police. Which shows you that London is, is financial. The UK is not a country. You should know that. It's a corporation. It trades on the stock exchange as the UK Limited. Same with the US. US Limited. They trade them the stock exchange. So all this is about business. It's strictly business. EPMD, baby. You heard me? So back to um, this Queen Elizabeth. Yeah, I said it. Hmm? She's your queen. Don't mind. She your queen. Queen Elizabeth. Black man. She your queen. Don't be shy. She's your queen. That's what I'm saying, man. When it comes to cooling, I ain't playing that shit. I took you straight up and down like four flat tires. So. Yo, check this new one, right? Now, four weeks ago, no, three weeks ago, right? Um, the Queen was meant to go to the Caribbean island of Barbados, right? Because there was the independence going on. Check this out. All these Commonwealth islands, Jamaica, Barbados, Trinidad, all that. I got love for all of y'all, you're all my peoples and all that. But you ain't independent, you gotta wake up for that. Because the highest court of your land is what the Privy Council. Guess what the Privy Council is? The Privy Council reside here in London, United Kingdom. You know, during the fornication of that harlot, the Queen Elizabeth. Revelation, I'm uh, not religious. Anyway, and these, these Privy Council, these fat wig guys who meet on a Thursday and do funny handshakes. What's the day, Thursday? Yeah. They're meeting right now. Up there in Croydon doing funny handshakes. And they're rolling on the dice saying things like, shall we let this guy go in, in uh, the penitentiary in Barbados? What's it called, Glendo? Shall we let this life go? Let's roll the dice. Nah, I think not. No. And, and that's the highest court of the land in the Caribbean, the Privy Council. So you're not independent. So what Barbados done is they told Britain, like, we don't want the Queen no more as a mother. We're going to elect a, 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 a Republican. Like bring a president. The Britain's like, Barbados, hold on man. Bib, you are drooling the crown. If you do this, Jamaica's gonna copy, um, uh, Montserrat's gonna copy, Trinidad's gonna copy, St. Vincent's gonna copy, Guyana's gonna, everyone's gonna wake up and we lose. So, there was a big ass flood the day before Prince um, Harry, they sent Prince Harry there. Now check this, the troops on every island, Antigua and all that, when Prince Harry came off, Representing his grandma, he didn't come off in, in military uniform. But military uniform greeted him. He came off with a suit on, which means he was there in a business capacity. Don't you get it? She sent him in a business. She says she's too old now to fly long haul. I bet you my bottom dollar, that was Canada, Commonwealth, New Zealand, Commonwealth, or Australia, Commonwealth, or Malaya. She'd have been there in a shot. No, but they Man, they would've, they would've, listen, they would've dug Big Bird up. You know what I mean by Big Bird? They would've dug, they would've dug Concord up herself and flew her ass over there and make sure she get there in four hours flat. 
where the average nigga takes 24 hours to get to Australia. You think what I'm saying? I ain't even playing no day. So, so the dude landed in Barbados, right? The day before the independence, which really should have been the swearing in of a, a president. But they've seen like the monarchy is still there, right? So, Barbados got flooded. Long story short, flooded. The water was up to here. Don't believe me. Check it out for yourself. Where was the aid? The water was up to here, man. In Barbados. It's unheard of. The most easterly island. Flooded? Where was the aid? Haiti didn't get cholera until they got the water from America. You see what Where the was boat. the aid? Where was the aid? As soon as they get aid, they get your, drop your... Yeah, British naval ships off the coast. Where was the aid? They sat their back at Barbados. All because Barbados said, we don't want the Queen no more, we're going to wake up and wake up the rest of the world. It got flooded, so they lost a lot of money. That was financial. That was a warning. Exactly. Like and you're all there putting the, these things on your Facebook. Remember when you put like the French flag on your status? And you put the Union Jack, there's no black on your status. And you put the US flag on your status. And you're eating your million turkeys on Thanksgiving because they're banging over there and say thank you. And you're celebrating that shit. Now you're giving it for this crimbo shit, another fallacy. You don't need to wake up, man. It's time to nation build. And, and sadly, even a so-called quote-unquote conscious community of all You know what happened to the Elder Body and all that? The Elder uh, what's going on everywhere? Scholarship, ownership. The only ones who really got it is the new albums, I gotta say it, man. Seriously, you really want a way out? Vote Malachi York as your president. Like, literally. There's nothing stopping you. Even if you're born in the UK and you hold a British passport, you can change your nationality. They can't abridge that. You can put your nationality as, as a chocolate ice cream if you want to. You can put pyramid head. You can say your nationality is Klingon. <laughs> I ain't even lying. Go and check it out. As an indigenous people, uh, Charter 215, United Nations, da, 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 you know what I mean. You can, you can put your nationality what you want, even if you do hold a United Kingdom passport of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. All right? You can put nationality what you want. If you're more, put more if you think that's nationality. But you can put the Wapian as a nationality, it's recognized. You fools are sleeping, man. You fools are sleeping. Get behind the ambassador, the important ambassador, my brother, go see your. Support that. Yo, study the history of Ghana. Right? Don't you know? No. Carmen, Carmen. Where was he when he got elected president? He was sat in a jail cell. And they elected him president and he got released as a president. And they want to. Yo, don't get it, do you? And then they. Malachi to York right now is sat in the worst pan on the planet Earth. ADX Max in the hills, in the mountains of Colorado, um, Florence, California. We got to drug him out of the rock. You know he's innocent. Nah. That's the media, according to Crow, doing what they do best. We spread lies and propaganda. Y'all gotta get him out. Y'all gotta get him out. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gotta bring him out, man. But anything, you gotta free yourselves anyway. What's your status? People talking about status creation. What is your status? What nationality are you? Any of y'all. Party down nationality. Let's go for everybody. I'm saying they should be trying to work as a nationality. It's recognized. What do you think about falling asleep, man? You think? If you want to know more, come on out to work. Brooklyn Keck, New York. And I told you already, man. Every day. All day, every day, you right? heard? 0793 man. Hey. Big things going on, we're doing a school, this side of the river, the ship on North, but we're working on it. We're down there, we're doing a school, we got all that. We need computers, we need all that. Papers, books, and all that. Oh, and, and real recognize y'all, big shout out to my boy back in Brownsville, but then you are Q Butter, because he's doing it. He's putting the knowledge where it is, they got the school, and all that. I'm just gonna say school, I'm gonna say an academy. Q Butter, my bad, not a school, an academy. People coming off the streets, we can get a GED, we can learn, children, older, whatever age. Like the movie um, First Graduate with an 82 year old, went back to school in Kenya and got his degree. That's an excellent, I love that movie. And I movies like um, Great, Great Debater. I have lots of books. Riley you can have different <laughs> age groups. Please donate. Call that me. No, Bring somebody that. have No, somebody you have got to books? come. Donate them to me. Come and collect donate. it. Come and collect them. I will. And you can donate to my um, PayPal, is my email address, that's Brooklyn Mubar at 2013yahoo.com. If that's going too fast for you, just tap in the home tree stem on your internet, whatever you call that, worldwide web stuff. The home tree stem, the home tree stem. Brooklyn Kick Mubar, yeah? Free Malachi's you got. Ah, shit, what? Stop playing around, man. You know what time it is, time is now, man. Yo, come on in. 
check this out, man, as we, as we, as we wonder. As we wonder. As we wonder. My brother's from the BCP, man. Black Child Promotions up in this piece, you heard me? My man Anthony, don't ever come out of Bricks and Subway and don't support my brother right here with energy. I'll say something. Um, what you have here is, Our chemistry. is a combination of like, different crystals, gemstones that help to amplify and transform the negative charge in the whole. You better amplify your voice. So, <laughs> so basically, you. basically it's a combination of crystals, resin and, and metals. And they, they help to transform the negative weight. So if you place them next to computers, laptops, it changes the molecular structure. So you say the vibration of like the, the energy in the room. So it brings it the point. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So the, the blood of humans <laughs> is liquid crystallization, right? So our blood is liquid crystallization, right? And we know that crystal is frozen light. Hence we are light beings. So if you sat in front of a computer all day, Break down what the guy electricity is doing when it's causing the human um, EMF, the electromagnetic field, and how your um, yeah, 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 yeah. better bring them out. Like what a uh, great doctor, Delbert Blair, who's an ancestor now, who ascended, used to break down as well very eloquently. Over yeah. the hill. So basically, just sitting down next to a computer and so being constantly charged with radiation. Therefore, means your body is high up, your bones will start to leak, and over time, you start to walk and you have to have tracks. So, the reason that's because of the computer, there's so much radiation that is leaking the The EMF, which is obviously an extremely deadly energy, which will actually start to deteriorate your brain. And on the other hand, you feel like heavy and depressed. So it causes depression. So just having some of these devices will help to kind of minimize that, that element. Ooh. Transform and take that negative charge from what we're better feeling against, against the world there. So that, so that whole depression, because you're losing the energy, the pressure, the pressure, like when they punch you in a dentist, when they put the needle in you, the pressure. So that's really, they're entering you via what? By your lowest chakra, your lowest vibration, basically. That's right. That's right. That's your root chakra. So, we yeah, are here trying to elevate people back to their top chakra. And, and even chakra, we get caught up in Hindu words, uh, in the middle nature, be a uh, second shinra. So you're raising yourself. Follow the change. You're being back in tune with mother nature. You're nurtured by nature naturally. And then you're in tune with the cosmos. If you're in tune with the cosmos, you're in tune with the universe. You're in tune with the universe, you're in tune with the multiverse. You're in tune with the multiverse, you're in tune with the omniverse, omnipresent. So you are all that, plus the tax. You dig me? So if you're eating by nature, you nurture by nature, you not to be an ontologist. You not to be an animist. But when I say to the people like yo, I'm like, what do you do that? Bring it on. Speak in there. Yeah, so it's about elevating the mind really more than anything. The reason why we're dumbed down is because we're eating wrong, you know, we're, we're not cleansing, you know, we're not connecting with nature, we're not grounding, we're not going by nature and taking off our shoes and then putting our feet into the earth. You know, that's why we're so great there. Like in the Caribbean Islands or in the Florida states, you walk barefooted, you put your feet in the sand and you walk. Energized up. You get that real vitamin B12. The vitamin B12, as they said it in the store, that's fake. It's covered. It's covered. It's It's in your lung and test lines already. And that's why you got to study astrophysics. These things are not boring. You've got to understand the correlation between the bad between and how these people are the There's a correlation to the bad behavior. You think And we've all been there. And age on this planet is a disease. I'm 49, I refuse to age. Busters, straight like that. Moving on, we got the BCP brothers right here. Say mm. side to the camera. Yes. What you got? You know I love this book, man. Break it down, sir. Amos Wilson. Blueprint for Black Power. There's a lot that's said about the, the past. This one tells you about going forward. Solutions. Solutions. You understand? We have become apathetic towards power, My job meaning that us uh, attaining power makes us victims of power. <laughs> I've said it before many times, I've said it, uh -huh. we deny the ambiguity of power to our peril. Our refusal to accept its existence doesn't make it suddenly banished from reality. It's therefore our obligation to understand this thing called power and use it to benefit ourselves and our families. 
economic power, political power, power in all forms, we need to attain it. And that can only be attained through collective economics. But she can't take the town. Where can they find you at, um, Facebook? You can find us on Black Child Promotions. Black Child One Word Promotions. On the Facebook. And on the, what's the, give them the Instagram. Instagram, INXT. That's INXT, Black Child Promotions. Yo, what's your um, Insta? Insta, Black Child underscore promotions underscore N1 underscore KAY. Come check us out. Facebook, Leonigas the Realist. And Facebook, Noel N -E N O E L K A Y. Yeah. That's it. Please. Black Child Promotions. Straight like that, right. moving on. Where's the vendor? We got a missing vendor. Oh, you're right here. What's your name? What you represent? That's the Mario Party. You're going to amplify your voice, brother. A little louder. Okay. That's the Mario Party. Okay, break down a little something, something about this. Okay. So this is cross curriculum. Hold it up here, hold it up. The key word right there is homeschooling. Alright? Teaching science, arts, science. STEAM. You know STEAM? You know like STEM? STEM? Yeah, all that. Each one. Abundant Santa, the stem. With your boy Brooklyn Nubar, the Brooklyn Kick Nubar, the home tree stem, you know. Don't worry, the, the, we're gonna we're gonna take the cameras to the place. I'm not gonna say school, we're gonna use that word, academy, whatever. We're gonna use that. We're gonna bring you in. And I already mentioned about what you can donate, like materials, paperwork, uh, science stuff, scopes, whatever, computers, any old computer you think you don't need, bring it on. We can put that to the children and they can repair it. They'll be learning technology. You know what STEAM stands for? So all the things you just said, mathematics. I don't care, I don't even care if you got old Rubik cubes. You know what a Rubik cube can do to a child as opposed to a PlayStation 4? The idiot thing? A Rubik cube can play games. You feel what I'm saying? Anything you got. I don't care if you got old Monopoly games and chess boards. Keep it checking. But chess boards and things of that nature. You dig me? Like, bring them up. We're trying to empower the youth. Like We're trying to show them how to use their brain like proper, interactive, and books, especially books. Bring them. If you can't donate money, bring your books, bring your test stuff. bring your science stuff, bring your Rubik cubes, I don't care. Bring anything you got. Remote control, cars, we can, McConnell, we can take things together and put it together again. But we got to keep these children off the streets and this time of year. We trying to get things done. We ain't about that talking shit. Good? Stay like that. Hold you stand, man. Get some closing words out here. We can end up with some questions if you got any questions. I know you don't care. I know you don't care. I know you don't If the brother want to chime in, just chime in. What do you like about the energy out here, late nights in Bristol? What, what do you know, to be fair, to be fair, yeah, is a, is a, what can I say, man? Is it like a trilogy, you know, Brixton? You mentioned Brixton, you mentioned Punk, you remember Black Brixton? Yeah, you know what I mean, because back in the day, when the, you know, it's the right center, yeah, the yeah, right yeah. center, that's all. You know what I mean? But you know what, one thing when I moved to, when I came out to like this, you know, what, 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 I came from Hackney. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I'm yeah. saying. But that's similar cool. demographic though. No, I wouldn't say Hackney, so. but I wouldn't say so. Um, the reason I wouldn't say so is because right. Hackney is like borderland east. Yeah. 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 Borderland east. Right. Yeah. So I was wondering, 
in their costume, I know they're reflecting a culture. I know it's all fake, it's all allegorical, synagogue and all shit from all that, I don't need to go deep. Same with Golders Green, same with Vincent Hurst in Brooklyn. You know, they're not real Jews, you know that. Two up. Well, you know, in a fictitious state. Two up, two up. Well, yeah, if I go to um, Asianville, Ilford, <laughs> Deep East, if I go to, um, yeah, or if I go to Ealing Road, or Pudsey, the area he just said, which is um, the north um, of England, like in between Leeds and Bradford, what we call Asianville, no disrespect. But I'm saying their costume reflects their custom. Sure. But when we come into our so-called neighborhoods, well hoods because the neighbors left, when we come into our so-called areas, we're in somebody else's districts, which is highly populated, isn't it? We wear everybody else's costume. Therefore, we've accepted everybody else's culture. Costume, culture. I was downtown today, it was horrible. It was horrible, I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy. The people, the sheep were like, Chanel's so playing shopping Christmas for one day, some fake day. It's 2016, you got people sleeping in doorways, they're talking about Christmas, if you have a PlayStation. It's all commercial. It's not real. It's a ho ho ho. It's played one big game over you all. And it's somebody else's calendar anyway, that's why I don't know the game. Gregory's calendar, some uh, Pope Greg, where they're destined to add too much to it anyway. Like, we gotta get back into our I, I respect even the Chinese New Year, they got, at least they got their own calendar. Dogan's own calendar, Cyrus' own calendar, we should be on that. Because you know we're under two suns, right? You don't know, you better get to know. So I don't really recognize this, this, this um, not even, not even just the Christmas or even the New Year. It's another day to me. Because it's out of sync anyway. You don't know. You, you don't know your zero time reference. You don't know if it's January the 1st. Family, you, you know, know about that drink, you isn't it? You don't know. You, you know what I'm saying? You don't Family. know. They phone it all off, right? Family. You know man, I'm getting off here, but welcome to this. It's all great, man. Who would you stand? Thanks for that. Definitely. Are you here? Are you posted up? Gotta pause and see your part two, man. You know what it is, man. I love it. 